This is the easiest thing for his eyes to see to block or his eyes to see to grab. Either one, it doesn't matter. When he sees this, I pull it down. Now the knife just disappeared. And guess what? Now we start all over again. the video for you today. Hey! Hey! Pay attention! Stop what you're doing! Pay attention! About to teach you something. You said you want the secrets, right? So now I'm going to give you some secrets. So pay attention! Guys, on East, interesting. You see a lot of guys that do on East sticks, that work with on East sticks, they always show you a bunch of flash, but they never show you the substance of the stick. They show you all these pretty disarms, all these pretty fanning, pretty movement, pretty things you can do with the stick and the poking and, and, and yeah, all that is nice. I don't walk the street with this. So pretty movements, beautiful movements. You're in close doing the trapping, the hitting, the tapping, the tapping, the tap, 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 tap. Tapping, trapping, two inches together. Yeah, like if, like if you're gonna do that with some guy outside in the street. Hit, pass, rim, redirect, strike, pass, redirect, strike, pass, hit. It looks pretty. But how do I make this work for me when I don't carry it in the street? One, our concept. We're Filipino martial artists, we use the Filipino martial arts, but our concept behind the stick, you are not mastering the stick. I teach my people to master the movements of the stick. I need to know how the stick moves and flows. So I, when I don't have this, I can move and flow. The purpose of swinging sticks on both sides of your body is to build coordination and a flow because then, without no stick, now your body moves better. <laughs> Kenny, come on in here. So now, with the five angles of attack, I made multiple videos with that. You know the videos, one, two, three, four, and five. You've seen it. But three is three, one is one, two is two, four is four. It all stays the same and five is five. So this pattern is number three. Bring it back to number two. So you got three and two. Now number one and number four. Three, two, one, four. Very simple, very effective. You need to pay attention because these are the secrets. Forget about this. Can you come over here and shoot that video? Shoot that from this side, please. So we're coming number three. Number three, the weapon come back to me. So as I put three, I pull it back to me. Number two, my body. Three, two, circular motion, one. Coming across, four. Not across this way, but our number four, which forms the X. Four. Three, pull it back, two, move in, one, circular motion, and four. Very powerful movement. I want you to put a clock on, take your cell phone, time yourself on your cell phone, and move. Three, pull it back, two, circle, one, and four. Three, two, one, and four. Three, two, one, and four. Now, that's how you do it with a stick. I want to show you the importance of this because now you do it with a knife. Three, two, one, and four. Look at the way the hand motion is. Three, the weapon comes back to me. Two, I'm pushing it out there. Drop it down. One, coming across. Four. Now, why is that so important? You say, where's the secret? They don't have no damn secrets. That's a stupid ass pattern. Here's the secrets. Motion causes motion. So when I do number three, he's going to block number three. He's going to either block it like this, or he's going to drop his arm. If he drops his arm to block it, 
three goes into number one. So I'm learning to see if I did this and he dropped his arm, then he came into number one. It bounced to number one. Let's say he tries to block here and punch me in the face at the same time. So he's trying to do that. I block the punch. Look at it. Look at it. I block the punch. The punch is to my face. I block the punch. That still leaves that open. If he tries to do it with two hands. Okay? Now, if he blocked it, like Kenny did it the first time, go down with two hands and try to block. Now, he leaves this side of his face open. So, if he does this, because I did the number three, I strike with this, right? Come over so you can see. I strike with this. Then as I strike with this, because he didn't grab it, he blocked it. I strike and I still come back with the number one. Nothing changes. And I come back with the number one and the number two. Here, 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 and here. You starting to see the secrets yet? I think they do. Okay. Let's say I start with the number one. Because I can start anywhere I want. Mm -hmm. So I three, mm -hmm. right? Excuse me. I start with the number two, two. So I come from three to two. So instead of starting here, I start here. Now, look at this. This is the easiest thing for his eyes to see to block or his eyes to see to grab. Either one, it doesn't matter to me. When he sees this, I pull it down. Now the knife just disappeared. And guess what? Now we start all over again. Because when it disappears, from here, I'm going to grab this hand, and I'm going to go into three, and I'm going to come right back into two, come across back into one. You see, because when I did this, this, and this, now, boom, his mind is going to freak out. His hand, where's your motion? Boom. So, wherever I start, it doesn't matter. The next one is one, three, two, one. So if I started with this, now you just gave me three. And I got two, and I got one, and I got four. Because once he did this, this comes over, this comes over, smack, that comes in, and rip. So are you starting to see the benefits of this yet? No, maybe you're not. But you said, David, I don't carry a knife. I don't like a knife. I don't feel comfortable with a knife. Still practice it over and over and over and over. You know why? Because when a man gets in your face, if you watch the video I, I made that said, the name of the video is How to Win in the Street. How to Win in the Street. I told you to start with the high-low concept. Did I not? Exactly. I told you to set it up. Did I not? Absolutely. Okay, so now come over here. Come around this way, please. So now, if we're here, I need you right here. So this man get in your face. I put my hands in position. Remember the Wing Chun thing? Watch the video. My hands are here, I'm talking. I'm looking, I'm trying to explain. I moved on to the side. Now, the first strike was what? Three, two, one, four. So three, this is a useless strike for a guy who's strong and angry and I'm arguing with you and it could be summer or it could be winter. So I'm not gonna do this. It's dumb, right? You might have your hands down, so if I went to do this, mm -hmm. all, you, all you're gonna do is that, right? If your hands are down, right. now I'm not gonna let you put your hand in my face right. and my hands are down, right? So the only way I'm gonna attempt to do something like that is if your hands are down. So look at this. I need a number three strike. Remember I told you if you right hand then I'm going to move to this side. But that gives me power to go three, not with my hands, but the three angle, this side of the body, with my foot. So that's number three. Now when I shot his foot out, when I went like this first, his body moved, he's going to reach for balance. So as I kick his leg out, bang, 
Now look, what opens up? Number two opens up. Boom! Now, three, two. Now I go from here to, boom, to here. Now you, did you see the three, two, one? So this is three, this is two, whack, that's one. And now here's the four. Boom. Ah, yep. That's the secrets. So you never seen that. See, you didn't see that. All you seen, all you seen was this. All you seen was three, two, one, four. You didn't see nothing else. That's all you see. But the way I teach, if that's all you can practice, if that's all you have, all you can have, you don't have no time. Every day, three, two, one, four. Three, two, one, four. Three, two, one, four. Three, two, one, four. Move it. Three, two, one, four. Three, two, one, four. Three, two, one, four. Okay. Three, two, one, four. Move. Now you got something, and now you got some secrets. I got a lot more secrets. I got a lot more techniques inside the technique. So I need you to keep watching. I need you to pay attention. Kenny, tell them what to do. Uh, you want the secrets? All right, you want more secrets? Then here's what you gotta do, guys. You gotta hit that subscribe button right now. You gotta like, comment, subscribe right now. You gotta share the video right now. Guys, come on, keep it going. Thank you very much. Peace.